The Kinsman Project with Kadri Gopalnath is, um, well, that's very dear to my heart. That was, uh, you know, a big experiment that I'm glad worked. You know, How did that start? Out. How did you meet him? Well, I'd been a fan of his since I was in college. He, there was one album before the days of the internet when you could find stuff online and download MP3s. Uh, he only had one album available in the U.S. called Saxophone Indian Style, which I thought was a hilarious title. And actually, my older brother bought it for me as a total joke. And, uh, but I knew about him. I was like, oh my God, where did you find this album? And, and for me, that was a great, uh, a great way to engage with Indian music because although I was listening to a lot of it, emulating, technically emulating a lot of uh, the ornamentation in Indian music is very difficult on the saxophone because of the physical you know, mechanics of the instrument. Mm -hmm. And here was a guy who was actually figured out how to do that, you know. So, and I also felt like I could listen to that album and learn from it in the same way I was with like Coltrane or Charlie Parker or whoever. Um, so I did, he did a concert when I first moved to New York in 97. He did a concert here just a few weeks after I moved here and I didn't have a chance to meet him then. But then he played in Boston again a few years later and I drove up there to see him and um, and we talked backstage. I gave him an album and he gave me one of his. Oh, and okay. We talked about trying to do something. And to this day, I'm not sure if he ever listened to the album I gave him, uh -huh. but he was so intrigued that there was a, a South Indian guy playing jazz alto saxophone. And he's, he's from Karnataka also. Yeah, he is. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So he was blown away by that aspect. He's like, yeah, we have to do something together. And, you know, through a convergence of events, you know, thankfully Rachel Cooper at the Asia Society right. um, got behind the project, and we got some great funding from the Rockefeller Foundation and a few other sources. and. And we're able to, you know, make this happen.